we want to evaluate the given expression. Notice how we have subtraction and addition, which have the same priority in the order of operations, and therefore we subtract and add from left to right. However, we do have to have a common denominator to add and subtract fractions. To find the least common denominator, we need to find the least common multiple of five, four, and three. And since the only common factor among five, four, and three is one, the least common denominator, LCD, is equal to the product of the denominators, which is five times four times three, which is equal to 60. So let's go ahead and write each fraction as an equivalent fraction with the denominator of 60. Since five times 12 is equal to 60, we multiply the numerator and denominator of two-fifths by 12. Since four times 15 is 60, we multiply the numerator and denominator of one-fourth by 15. And since three times 20 is equal to 60, we multiply the numerator and denominator of two-thirds by 20. And now let's write the equivalent fractions. Two-fifths is equivalent to 24 sixtieths. One-fourth is equivalent to 15 sixtieths. And two-thirds is equivalent to 40 sixtieths. Now that we have a common denominator, we can subtract and add from left to right. The denominator is going to remain 60, and the numerator is 24 minus 15 plus 40. Twenty-four minus fifteen is nine. Nine plus forty is forty-nine, giving us forty-nine sixtieths. The only common factor between forty-nine and sixty is one, and therefore we know forty-nine sixtieths is simplified. I hope you found this helpful.